What's up, y'all? So what we're going to have today is a motivational Monday. Yeah, motivational Monday. So let's just say that uh, you're at the top of your game, right? And uh, you're in your bag, as some may say, in your bag. You're clicking on all cylinders. And and uh, you may uh, tend to uh, want to let others know and the public know that you're on top of your game verbally and and it may not be re, re, it may or may not be received well by some people you know you may get called arrogant conceited or full of yourself you know, on your high horse etc etc all this stuff but I want to say uh, let all that talk go in one ear and out the other because they're trying to bring you down off of your square you know so they can so they so you can be uh, average or mediocre like they are you know it's low key it's low key hate or even high key hate <laughs> that's just it what it is Because um, the only way, well, the, an integral part of becoming the best is to believe it and and say it. Put it out there in the atmosphere and let it manifest that you're the best in whatever it is that you're doing. You know, if you don't believe it, it just ain't going to happen. So... Ignore all that ne- negative talk and ignore the negative nances and the, and the uh, David Downers and and uh, people like that. Ignore them. Take it with a grain of salt. You know, don't pay them no attention. And uh, so. Because I'm starting, I'm seeing this play out in the NBA. I've been seeing it play out in the NBA for for the past week or so. Now, now granted, this this uh, conglomerate um, media outlet has come forward and apologized for publishing a fake quote, a fake yeah, a fake quote made by this young. Um, up and coming superstar, you know, because he he came out and said that uh, he was quoted. Well, he was misquoted. He said that if he was playing in in a guy's era, and the guy he's he's talking about who he's referring to, uh, he's a Hall of Famer. He's won several MVPs. He's won six finals. He got six championships. He, he appeared in several NBA finals. And this young man said, if I was playing in his era, I would cook him. I'd cook him too. <laughs> and some perceive that as being arrogant, you know. They say he need to settle down. He need to be more humble. He too cocky. He doing too much. He's saying too much. But it turned out to be fake. It turned out to be a hoax. It turned out, it turned out to be fake news. But I think he did say something, but they might have blew it out of proportion or took it out of context, context as usual, you know. But even if he did say it, so what? That say so what, you know. Like I said, you know, you want to be the best, put it out there in the atmosphere, put it out there in the universe, let it manifest, so let it manifest. So it's called speaking it, speaking things into existence, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So... I just wanted to hit you all with that. Some people may uh, may not 
need to hear something like that this morning to start their week off. So, I will wrap with you all later. Peace.